PlayStation 4, I am highly addicted to in a lot of ways. So today we're going to be going through one of uh, the newer expansions in the list, and that is the Rogue One Scarif map. Now, I've been playing this a lot recently, and I really enjoy it. I've met, I've met some people who are not too big on it because it's it's a beach. It's it's a beach and a lot of differences. I mean, it follows suit to the Death Star, where the Death Star expansion pack gave us the the whole going through each level continuously like a chapter. So that's the same direction they've gone for this, and yeah, I don't mind it. It adds more to it, because really when they released this, it was before the movie released. And it adds a lot more to, I guess, the game itself as a whole. Now, I've not yet seen Rogue One. I'm watching it this week at some point, and I'm looking forward to it. But right now, we are focusing more on this, and um, let's see where we can go with it. Now, I've been adding more videos to my YouTube, just because I rarely get to use YouTube. And I thought it might be cool just to do a video on this. Okay, so Infiltration Scarif Beach. Let's see what chaos always says, shall we? Okay, so... The first part of this, of course, is we have to get one of our viewings through that gate. So... By random chance, players will be voted to be one of the uh, the U wings and try and get to the to the very end. Simple as, but you know, it's fire squadron with something add on top, so that's cool. All right, let's see what we can do. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, here we go. Now, you only get to use an X-Wing on this. Scarif is protected by a shield gate. We need to fight our way through it in order to reach the planet's surface. Alright, this is it. Stay alert. So yes, someone has been chosen to be a U-Wing. And... Yeah. Okay, so let's find some TIE Fighters. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not too big on the Fire Squadron games because you don't get the points that you hope to get. Before the main goal is now the thing. So we've got the U wing for the gate, and now we are in for the Find a secure landing zone. We'll mobilize from there. Go for the the eleven and we've landed into into close to our objective. Rebel troops advanced toward the rail speeder station and created a diversion for our team. An Imperial cargo ship would be a good target. Push the Imperials back. Do not let them near your explosive charge. I got one list. Now of course with the new expansion pack. You do get the new armor, the shore trooper armor, 
As for the Death Trooper, unfortunately, I don't think that's going to be available as for oh, armor. As I think it will be at some point, but not not right now. From what I can tell you, you Our device on become the a Death Trooper only when Drive the, the Admiral needs someone by his side. It, it, it's, it's like the whole Palpatine thing all over again. Director or the Palpatine. Is in the vicinity, targeting him yeah, could deal a real blow to the Empire. So he can have Death Troopers by him. This is really cool. Protect your explosive charge. Don't let the Imperials disarm him. First game of the day, so you know. And uh, there are a few different matches on this deck. Are quite good. You still get blast. You still get your traditional games as much as they are. Oh, son of a bitch. Battle Bro 084. How many factors I play this better on drunk? Uh, you need to retake the area around the cargo ship and rearm the explosives. <laughs> I'm gonna go for something faster out for. I think a faster gun will be more appropriate for uh we'll go for the A two eighty C. We need that charge to go on. Do not let the Imperials near it. I have always checking just how many kills I have. The Imperials have neutralized our explosive device. Push them back and re-arm. Enemy unit nearby! The good thing about this map is that it is great camouflage for a lot of the rebels and a lot of the troopers. But it is one of those moments where you're having fun, true enough. But sometimes it gets a bit weird. And we got me double E4, not bad. Here, some reason my internet is to be a quick. No idea why. Now, the star card I have, or the, uh, is, well, the Disruptor gun. By far, one of the slowest working, if not the useless guns I have ever seen on a game. Level 1 load. Level 2 load. Fire. And you fire it if they get rid of it. disarm your explosive charge. Getting round and round, doing what I think he is. Thunder point score. My first game of the day, I'm doing all right. That Although it's at that point where if you're up late, then your eyes were adjusted to this entire thing.
almost there. Hold the Imperials off those charges. I think after this, we have the same map, but we have a different mission to fulfill. It's that point, you know, when something explodes that you, you're not going to escape in time. We're on the same mission, a uh, different chapter of the mission, so it's an extension to what we were doing before, which I find is pretty cool. Remember, invisible palm trees are everywhere. And invisible palm trees will fuck you up. Get the Imperial Gates take safety to our ship. Uh, Battle Birds again. Uh, let's try something a bit more lenient. I've not used this in a while, so I might as well see this what we can do with it. Before the uh, first few expansion packs, this was one of my personal favorites. Still is. few trigger blocks and uh, you're in. The only annoying thing about it is the uh, refresh. Button. So we're going to go for his higher up, which is going to be the uh, WE4. And this Don't let the Imperials reclaim that stings. Day. Keep heading towards your ship. connection there. Hmm. Apologies for the bad connection. Uh, for some reason, Virgin Media and all its wisdom, being a complete pile of shit, is uh, acting up. So, you know, we can buy that one out. Bad. Compared to last night, we're at least seeing some people with some. So those are the points. We are not in the top because you have to earn other pieces. Oh. Oh. 
That happened. I'm not good at drinking them, because normally when I get that drink, I'm a bit more reflexed. I don't know. But I'm having fun either way. I got some so. Huh, flying exploding shot. Not bad. This is uh, the point where you think there are bombs everywhere. And you're right, because there are bombs everywhere. That's the problem we have on the street. You need to get the data tape the cactus. They have bombs. Death. Beach ever, right? Called Boom Beach. Scatter gun. Get out of there. They have reinforcements arriving. We need that data. Ah, so got it. I've got the combat master uh with them. I mean that's you always get that. It's still cool to get. So I didn't do too bad. Um because I'm better, but you know, I'm having one of those mornings. Well, I call it morning. I know it's not even morning right now, it's just uh I've been sleeping all day. I was sleeping all day because, you know, I've been traveling up and down this country like a, like a hermit with a mission. Okay, so I think I'm going to end this one here. As so I uh, want to at least I uh, get some other stuff done. But I wanted to do a quick video. Not my best, but the next one I'm going to do. Um, well, I got a bottle of sour in the fridge, so let's see how that all ends up.